Canada Steamship Lines. One of the first ships of the shipping year on the St. Lawrence Seaway makes its trek into the Great Lakes system, going toward the Great Lakes on the mighty St. Lawrence River. Hi, I'm Moondong Bear, and this is the mighty St. Lawrence River, where we're seeing a CSL, or Canada Steamship Lines ship making its trek toward the Great Lakes on, must, on what must be one of the very first days, if not the first day of the shipping season. Of course, this is mostly frozen during the winter, and these great ships cannot travel, of course. But with spring here, <laughs> late March spring, it's still pretty cold, this ship, these ships are free to travel. All the buoys, I'm, I assume, have been placed as these ships rely upon an elaborate system of buoys and navigational tools to guide them through the St. Lawrence Seaway. The St. Lawrence Seaway, of course, connects the Great Lakes with the Atlantic Ocean and effectively makes Great Lakes ports essentially ocean ports that can handle extensive ocean traffic. So there we have one of the first ships of the 2010 shipping season making its way toward the Great Lakes. Going upstream, that's right, the St. Lawrence River is one of the few rivers in the world that flows north. It flows from the Great Lakes to the Atlantic Ocean. The ship going upstream as it passes on this beautiful early, early, early spring day on the St. Lawrence River. And I'm Boondong Bear. Thanks for watching.